Hello, this is Ray Snow. So last time I explained how to make a jar file with images. So uh, you can still see images in your program even after you exported it as a jar file. And recently I was asked then uh, how to do that with uh, not image but uh, audio files. So such as sound effect or music. So this time I'm going to explain how to include audio files into your JAR file so you can still hear and play music or sound effect files by clicking your JAR file. So let's start. And to explain this, I'm going to use this play sound program so we have created before. This is a very simple program. So if you click this sound effect button, then you can hear this click sound and if you click this music button then you can uh, listen uh, to a music file and uh, we have these three files three java class so this sound sound class and also sound effect class and also this music class if you run this program from this Eclipse, then you can play the sound effect or music. But if you export this program as a jar file, jar file, and uh, I'm gonna name this as a play sound, play sound dot jar, and uh, sound and finish. Then we have this play sound.jar file and open this and click this button. But you cannot hear anything even if you click these buttons. So to play this sound effect or music file after exporting it as a jar file, then uh, we have to change our program a little bit. So okay, let's delete this for now. Okay, first step is just like we did for those uh, jar file with images, right click on the project name here and select properties and here Java field pass and select add folder and add this resource folder and okay. So now uh, this is on the resource folder has been added to this source tab and apply OK. Hmm. Okay, then uh, we're gonna use this URL and name this URL. So this time, right click sound URL or something. Okay, and let's import this URL. So URL has been imported and here, so last time we used this click sound string to specify the location of the audio file, but we don't use this anymore. So let's comment out this and uh, instead we type like this, click sound URL. Uh, this is the, the URL we just created here and equal get class bracket get uh, resource resource and inside of this bracket uh, let lo click the up. So basically same as this, little click wap, uh, this one, little click wap. And uh, let's make another URL for music. So, and uh, then, so we're gonna make a URL for this Taba music. So let's name this as a Taba music uh, URL. And so let's comment out this one. 
send tavern music URL equal get class dot get uh, resource and this time so we're gonna use this one my music so this is a music file so uh, type here as my music dot wap hmm okay so we don't use this these two strings anymore so but last time we so from here we send this click sound or taban music to sound effect class or music class but this time we are not sending string but uh, we are sending url information instead so so we're gonna change this part as well so from click sound to this one click sound url so here click sound url url and also here from tavern music to this url tavern music url hmm. and uh, yeah you're seeing error because this sound effect file class is expecting string so this is expecting to receive string information so we change here from string to url hmm? ah, and the import url hmm. and we don't use this file file new file this line anymore so you can delete this i just comment out for now and instead we change this file to this sound file name like this hmm. and we're gonna do the same thing inside of this music class as well so first change this string to url url and we don't we don't need to use this first line anymore and change this file to this sound file name hmm. okay and import this url hmm. and uh, since we don't use this file anymore so maybe mm, you can change this method name as well set the file like uh, hmm, maybe set the url and uh, also set url hmm. and then in the case here as well set the url this way it's uh, i think it's easier to understand hmm. and this is done so let's check the program so first let's run this program from this eclipse okay sound effect so you uh, you can still hear sound effect or music mm. so, yeah it's working so far and uh, then let's export this program as a jar file right click on this project name and export and the jar file and play sound okay and the name play sound 2 and the next next sound and uh, finish okay now we got this play sound 2 that jar file okay so let's check this right and click this sound effect yeah so you can play sound effect and the music so you can still play music even after exporting it as a, a jar file mm. so that's how to include audio files into a jar file so basically first you need to add this rest folder as a source a source folder and uh, then make 
this URL and set the file into this URL this one and this one and send this URL information to this sound effect class or music file hmm. then you can play it okay so yeah okay so that's everything about how to make a jar file with audio files thanks for watching and see you again bye